wild animals running around right into people's yards. And Channel 5's Kristen Von Pricing uh, here in our studio to explain that Wasilko Animal Control is after javelinas once again. That's right, it's not the first time they're picking up javelinas in the middle of town, and they think it's because people are trying to make them pets. Today on Oklahoma and Merida Streets in Westlaco, a call about a small pack of dogs on the loose. One was even reported to have bit someone. Westlaco Animal Control is tasked with finding out where they are and getting the animals before they can do more harm. Yesterday, it wasn't dogs, it was javelinas. It's unusual, but it does happen sometimes. Animal Control Officer Michael Cruz says it happened near this intersection in Westlaco. They had to jump out and tranquilize. He says it was already attracting a crowd. Uh, we can't um, risk them charging, the, the, the animal charging at a person, so we had to go to that recourse of tranquilizing the animal. He says it took seven people, several to control the crowd and some to keep track of the javelina. Once you tranquilize it, they tend to run. So then um, that way we don't lose it. Well, there was more than one. Nancy Bazan owns the daycare Little Adventures by where the two javelinas were tracked by animal control. I think it's a big safety concern for parents, a concern for even just the residents in general. It's rare, but it isn't the first time in Westlake. Last March, animal control picked up this javelina. Crew says they make the chattering sound to defend themselves. So if you were able to see one or it's in your property, like in this case, we advise you not to go towards it. Keep away and call it into animal control. We'll take care of you. Westlaco Animal Control says they think people could be picking up javelinas out in the country and trying to raise them. And they reiterate that's not legal in the city. They say the one they caught was released back into the countryside. In the Channel 5 News Studio, Christian Von Pricing, Channel 5 News at 6.